Hey everyone, today is March 1st, 2023. Hope all of you have been a great day today and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, today is a new modification day and it's a mod that I usually wouldn't make a full video for, but the brand is really special and it's something I'm really excited for. So today I'm getting a new shift knob for my WRX. Um, this is a custom racing shift knob. Um, this was pretty expensive, it was about $200. Um, I customized this, made it red, and I made this exactly how I wanted, and it's a really, really high quality, heavy shift knob from racing. And as you can see, the reverse in the WRX is to the side and down. Um, this was a shift knob on my BRZ when reverse was to the left and up. And I thought it was time to get a new shift knob for my WRX, one that was really high quality and one that I wanted for a really long time. So today I'm picking up an ARC Burnt Titanium Shift Knob. If you guys don't know the brand ARC, they make high quality parts from Japan. So someone local to me is selling this shift knob and I'm gonna pick it up today and I'm so excited. So I just got off work, I'm gonna head right now to pick up this shift knob. And like I said, usually I wouldn't do a full video for a new shift knob, but the shift knob is expensive. It was something I always wanted when I had my BRZ. Now I have the opportunity to purchase it for my WRX. So we'll head to the guy's house right now and we'll pick up my new ARC Burnt Titanium Shift Knob. This custom racing shift knob is super high quality. Absolutely love this shift knob. But because I'm getting my new ARC shift knob today, I will be selling this. And like I said, this was about $200. I think I'm gonna sell for 120 just to get some money back. So if anyone wants to purchase this racing shift knob, I'll put the specs in the description below. Like I said, it is a custom shift knob and I'll be selling this really soon. Hope you guys enjoy this video today and let's pick up this new shift knob. guys so on the way to pick up my new ARC burnt titanium shift knob and it is a beautiful day in the Chicago area it's like 55 almost 60 degrees it is March 1st this is definitely the nicest day we had so this drive is gonna be really nice and this is my last drive with my racing shift knob I just took off my custom racing shift knob and this had the adapter on it to put on my WRX and this is a heavy shift knob really high quality finishing is phenomenal and I do love this but like I said it's for the BRZ not the WRX the reverse is in the wrong spot and let's put on this ARC burnt titanium shift knob all right guys just picked up this ARC burnt titanium shift knob Sorry about the fingerprints on here. It's definitely a fingerprint magnet. Look at that. It is beautiful. You have like the burnt blue purple on top and lower on the bottom you have like a gold, yellow, gold. And you can see my reflection and they're absolutely stunning. All right, let's get this installed here. And it's just a basic shift knob install but because it is an ARC shift knob I feel like having its own video is definitely worth it and I just picked up my puppy Coco her grandma was watching her for the last day and I picked up the shift knob installed it and I just picked up her to bring her back home and she's going to be a year old in two months. All right, let's do this first drive with this ARC titanium shift knob. Yeah, that looks so good. And 
that's the third new WRX I've seen driving on the road today, driving home from work. All right, let's get the first acceleration with this shift knob here. Feels good. It's definitely different having a spherical shift knob, but, and it looks badass. I'm so happy I got this. All right, let's do a quick downshift here. So that was the fourth new WRX I've seen driving home from work and picking up my puppy just now. And I don't see many of them, but I saw a lot today. And I'm still not 100% sure about them. Um, I mean, they're not growing on me. I just see a lot of them. I still like the V8 chassis better. The most common criticism is the plastic on the sides, and especially the back. The plastic goes so far up in the back. Tail lights, I mean, they're okay. They don't look bad, but it's all that plastic. And having to get it painted aftermarket is something you don't want to do with a brand new car. I like to make it look good. I saw a black one today, a black new WRX, and it looked pretty good, not gonna lie. Because with the black plastic, it matched with the paint, so you couldn't really tell it was plastic. All right, guys, so I've been driving about 25 minutes or so with the new ARC titanium shift knob, and it feels good. Um, I'm definitely getting used to the shift knob being a ball, being a sphere. Um, it looks stunning. When I look down at it, it looks absolutely awesome. Like I said, I'm gonna get a burnt titanium reverse lockout. Next interior mod I'm doing is getting a nice high quality carbon fiber steering wheel. That's the one thing I need. When I had my BRZ, for me, the most important interior mods were steering wheel and shift knob because those are the two things you'll touch the most. And the next thing I need though is a short shifter for this because the throws compared to my BRZ and this and the WRX, they're so long. Even the BRZ completely stock with stock shifter was a lot more notchy, shorter throws. Um, and with my BRZ, I did have a cart boy short shifter, which made it really short. I had a heavy shift knob and I wanted to try to get that kind of notchiness back. I feel like if I get a nice notchy short shifter, it'll make the driving experience with a WRX a lot better. All right, guys, I'm ending the video here. Hope you guys enjoyed this video today. I know this video wasn't too long, not too exciting, but I wanted to share my new ARC shift knob with all of you. I am so stoked about it, and right now I'm stockpiling modifications for my WRX. Um, show season is right around the corner, and I have a couple other mods that I'm not gonna tell you about yet, but I will be getting my aero pieces installed very soon. So this weekend, I'll be going to World of Wheels or Tuner Galleria at the Stevenson Convention Center in Schaumburg, Illinois. So if you guys are going to that show, I will be there this weekend. And I'm pretty sure I'll be there Saturday and Sunday. So please leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Please leave a comment down below what you guys think of my ARC shift knob and what kind of shift knobs do you guys prefer? Shape, weight, and let me know what brand you guys like. And I'm sorry about the quality. I use my iPhone for this whole video. Usually I don't use my iPhone for much filming, so I hope it came out okay. And remember, I respond back to every single comment I get. Peace out, and I'll see you guys in the next video.